Hey everyone, uh, this is my favorite green smoothie. Um, it's the morning for me. I had a bunch of water this morning and feel pretty hydrated and now I'm ready to eat. Um, I don't always have a green smoothie in the morning, but this one is really good um, and is usually the one that I go to first. So I'd love to make it with you and then I'll just share a few different ingredients that you can use instead of certain ones. So let's hop to it. So, and I use a, a magic bullet. I'm a big fan of these. So I have some frozen mango. And I don't have exact measurements. Anything that I do on these videos, I do not have exact measurements. <laughs> so that's why I like to show you um, how much I'm using so you can just visually see it. Um, I cut up a bunch of fresh cucumber. It has a lot of, uh, like I just, I'm all about a green smoothie, like less fruit, more vegetables, but vegetables that don't like have like a, a really intense bitterness to it. Cilantro is going to help um, add a really nice flavor to it. Um, I add half of an avocado. An avocado, frozen banana, um, frozen zucchini, uh, coconut oil are going to add a really nice creaminess to any to any smoothie. And then I add frozen peas. Some good protein in these. Um, and again, they, they blend up really nice and they make like a creamy, I'm all about creamy, citrusy, sweet, green smoothies. Those are like my go-to characteristics. I do lime. You can do lemon as well. It really brings out, um, I just find adding a citrus, like grapefruit, lime, lemon, even orange, combined with what I'm going to add next. It doesn't, um, you don't need as much sugar, so I'm going to add sugar next. Um, it's stevia, it's a stevia powder. I find that I don't have to add as much sugar if I add some citrus, because it, it adds to the flavor. I don't know, maybe it's a little less than a teaspoon, maybe a teaspoon. I don't measure. <laughs> I go for a flavor. So now um, I always put in my solids first, and then I fill up the liquid to like a little more than three-fourths. So I'm just going to fill up with some fresh water. And I don't put it up all the way because otherwise this is going to totally overflow. Close it up. I love to look at all the colors. Woo! <laughs> and because all of these videos are in real time, I'm gonna blend it. Let's check it out. Let's see how we did. Wouldn't be right if I didn't taste it in front of the video, right? So I can smell the citrus. Mango in any smoothie, especially frozen mango, so good. Yeah, nailed it. Could even add some more lime. Mmm, mmm, mmm. So this is gonna be my breakfast now. So good. Um, play around with ingredients. Um, other things that I have frozen in the freezer are different fruits, bananas, blueberries, blackberries. I love having frozen zucchini, frozen spinach, and frozen peas as vegetables. And then I add things like cucumbers and the other stuff that I add in here. So hopefully this was a fun little twist on um, a green smoothie. Oh, and another thing you can add to this is either chia or flax. All right, have fun with your green smoothies, y'all.